yes, it's me, Holly Agamar, back with an instant match reaction where Tottenham have just lost 4-1 away from home. How can we beat City and then lose 4-1? I, I just don't understand it. Anyway, if you're new to the channel, please remember to like, share, comment and subscribe so you never miss a video. Yes, uh, it's... Holly's Hotspurs back with another one Chatting all things Tottenham, we're second to none Special guests every time, if it's win, lose or draw The passion is high like Harry Kane when he scores So when Lloris makes a world class save We got Hoybier running the mid every game Settle down, stick around, share your thoughts with the panel And make sure you're subscribing to the channel Coys Yes ladies and gents, we have just lost 4-1 to Leicester City away from home. It has not been a good day in the office. Uh, well, we don't have Romero in the back line. It pretty much just all goes to crap. We might as well just not bother turning up. Uh, when you've got uh, Eric Dyer being doing his best impression of a mannequin at the back, it pretty much highlights how your day is going to go. But it started off well because we did manage to obviously get the first goal from a lovely corner from Perisic where Ben Tenkort managed to stick a foot out and put it in the back of the net. VAR did spend about 10 years trying to dissect with the lines and everything to see if it was a goal. It was a goal, it stood. But then from then, Leicester came out for themselves and just did the business. There's not much more I could do. Harvey Barnes that she had that right side on strings, could literally do what he pleased when he pleased. Uh, Fraser Foster I just don't know how to comment the man falls down in slow-mo uh, <laughs> it's probably the nicest way to put it um, but I don't want to be too disrespectful to Leicester because we did really obviously turn up the next gear and managed to basically slice us apart like they were carving butter uh, to be honest with you um, obviously <sighs> I'm going to call it out, Eric Dyer. I just, when he hasn't got Romero next to him, there is no point having him on the pitch. He was stuck in two minds today, whether to go forward, stand back, hang off. But you can't allow players to have that much room in front of our goal because they're just going to pick a corner and put it in. And that's quite really what Leicester did. Um, so, yeah, I'm just baffled how we've managed to beat City 1-0, then go to Leicester and lose 4-1. It is really beyond me. Obviously, we'll be dissecting everything on Holly Sotspurs Live on Monday. It's probably going to be <laughs> a long one, to say the least. I think we all need this one. And then we obviously do play Milan on Tuesday. So it'll be interesting to see what happens there. Um, after this game, not too hopeful. Uh, like I say, let comment, put your comments in the comment section below. Tell me how, what you thought of the game. And don't forget to subscribe. See you live on Monday. Up Spurs.